Welcome everyone to my YouTube channel, it's Moudin again. Uh, today I'm going to solve a uh, usually step one new word question of the psychiatry block. A 24 year old man comes to the physician due to excessive daytime sleepness. That's a keyword. The patient is a college student whose symptoms started around age 12 when he began ne needing more sleep than his beers to feel refreshed. That's a keyword too. Two years later, he started having daily episodes of sudden weakness consistently triggered by laughter or crying in which his head would not or his knees would buckle for about 30 seconds. The patient also describes times when he was unable to move for several minutes after awaking from sleep, which is muscle paralysis. He mentions nightly dreams that seem very real. Uh, often featuring activity that he had been engaged in during the preceding day. If measured, which of the following compounds is the most likely to be abnormal in the patient's cerebral spinal fluid? The correct answer here is hypocretin 1 because this patient's excessive daytime sleepness, episodic loss of motor tone triggered by emotion, which is called cataplexy, and inability to move on waking, Sleep paralysis are highly suggestive for narcolepsy. Narcolepsy with cataplexy is most often caused by the lack of the two related neuropeptides, which is hypocretin 1, which is called orexin 1, and hypocretin 2, which, which is called orexin B, which are produced in neurons located in the lateral hypothalamus. These neuropeptides promote wakefulness and inhibit uh, REM sleep related phenomena. Hypocretin 1 levels are low to absent in the cerebrospinal fluid of patients who have narcolepsy with cataplexy. And thank you for watching.